Between 2010 and 2012, Macquarie University led a project that was funded by the um, OLT. It was called the Peer Project. Um, as part of the project, a survey was conducted that involved Macquarie University and La Trobe University in Australia, the University of Pretoria in South Africa and Lund University in Sweden. The survey was then followed up with 30 interviews um, with Macquarie academics. And the data from the survey and the interviews was then used as a basis for the development of the model and the resources. The peer model illustrates how key elements of peer review relate to each other. At the heart of the model lies communication. The next layer describes the process of conducting peer review. And on the outer layer, we have leadership elements of peer review, such as culture, structure and processes. The communication element of peer review is supported by four videos that discuss key issues uh, of communication. The effect video um, discusses how comfortable people are with peer review and issues around respect and trust. The places video uh, looks at where peer review can take place and how the choice of place affects communication. The collegiality video refers to how peers interact with, with each other and how they share and negotiate feedback and information. And finally, the attitude video looks at how attitudes towards teaching and research affect approaches to peer review. The content of the videos is based entirely on the findings from the project. They are a flexible resource. They do not provide outright answers, but they're intended to stimulate reflection or maybe discussion in a workshop. The handbook relates to the process layer of the model. It is meant as a quick guide for anybody who intends to engage in peer review but doesn't have weeks of time to research how to go about it. Um, it can be downloaded from the website in its entirety to guide you through the process and the whole cycle of peer review. But you can also download individual pages to guide you through just one particular step you need help with. Documentation of the whole peer review process can be an important part. Um, so we have included forms into the handbook that can be downloaded either in PDF format, but also in Word format in case you want to customise them for your needs. The outer layer of the peer review model refers to the leadership of peer review. It contains process, culture, and structure, which is meant to illustrate that you need a process to actually facilitate peer review, but you also need a culture that values peer review. And last but not least, you need a structure that facilitates it. When we designed the resources, we wanted them to be practical, flexible, and useful. But above all, we wanted them to encourage people to engage in the peer review of teaching.